Hi everyone, bonjour tout le monde. Thanks for coming back everyone. This is just a few seconds of the infrared and we'll get into some nice close-up footage that I recently got two days ago or is it three now. There's that flash that we got yesterday, but here it is, a snapshot of it. And it's nothing I've ever seen that wide before. So we continue to examine and observe what's in the sky. Another great interaction for the first time, I must say, with the UFOs over my house and more and more are going to come in here just with a, a simple inversion look at the intensity wow my goodness of that flare the flash which is i'm telling you at least three or four times wider than any flash i've ever seen um either with a meteor or a satellite flaring this was something else and again an interaction with those ufos do you remember plato crater well i've shown it before uh, right here in the center, that egg-shaped crater. But along the Terminator line, um, there's elevated structures. And the reason why we're seeing those elevated structures, who knows? Probably because of the Terminator line. That's what gives us a peak through the veil, so to say. The Terminator line is the moon phase as it progresses. This dark line here, as we see all along that Terminator line, just some cool, awesome, very high elevated objects off the surface that are very visible that we can see. And again, the minute this Terminator line goes by, you just can't see it. I'll show you an example without the Terminator line. There's the elevated structures. Check it out. This is, you know, the Terminator line is past now Plato Crater, as you can see on the right there, not at all in the same area, like on the bottom there. But again, on the left in the live shot, no structures can be seen. Mons Argeus just east of Mare Serenitatis, the supposed Apollo 17 landing where they would have planted probes and set foot on the moon. Could have possibly disturbed the moon, they said. I don't know if they went or not. I'm not here to tell you that or not. I'm just telling you what we know is in the news is this area has always been the area of the supposed Apollo 17 moon landing. Look at Mare Serenitatis. Uh, I love it. The colors um, that are in there, always changing. Yes, they are always changing. Here, Mons Ardeus just with a simple straight up green filter.